hogs on the mob planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, seven seven cutty, black with the purple strip. All right, what's good, family? Okay, so this video. I let y'all know if you wanted me to answer any questions or get my opinion on anything, question put the com put the question in the comments and I will answer. So I got a question from the fam D3. All right. It says, hold on, let me make it bigger. It says, what's good, Kenfo? This is D3, and I have a question for you with the way that McDonald, E-I-E-I-O, I added that part myself, dominated the Shanahan scheme in San Francisco and the way DeMarco Ryans has the Texans playing pretty good. When Harbaugh eventually retires, would you prefer a defense or an offensive head coach to replace him? Obviously, last year, the Eagles' offense coaching staff was given head coach positions around the league, but they also say defense wins championships. What say you? Thanks again, bro. Now, that actually is a really good question. I saw that, and I was like, man, how can I respond to that? Because... I still haven't made this dang video and I really need to make it. But the reasons, as y'all, some people might not know, I live in Texas. Now, a Baltimore Ravens fan in Texas, born in Texas, raised in Texas, how the heck? But I'll explain everything, all that on a whole video. But that's what like, got my attention back in the day was the defense. Ray Lewis, Terrell Suggs, Ed Reed. The 2000 defense, I can't name all them people that they had. Rod Wilson. The defense is what really caught my eye. Heck, even when I used to play Madden back in the day. Back in the day, you had to share the controller when you were the youngest. I was the youngest. I played defense, obviously. So, that's what got my attention. Now, having a defensive coach. For the Baltimore Ravens and the fire that McDonald brings, that would be that would be nice. Like you see how the Eagles head coach, how he be talking smack to the opposing fans, make you know having fun with it. Now Hawes ain't that type of person, but McDonald, I don't know, but he brings that fire. Everybody on the freaking team loves this dude. Now, for offensive head coach, the only person I can think of is Eric Embiney. But the thing about that is, some people say he's strict. Some people say he's not. You don't know. But Ravens usually, like, usually have that ingrown talent in order for them to keep McDonald. He's going to have to get paid. So I would say defense because I can't think of really anybody on offense. Like Todd Munkin, he don't I don't see that I, don't, I see the fire a little bit, but he's not on the sideline. So you can't really see that interaction as much as you can see with McDonald. I know some people say, man, Todd Munkin, he done did some stupid plays. Like running Lamar. And I uh, thousand percent agree but mcdonald has messed up a lot some, some stuff too like middle of the field leaving that open a lot but i will say mcdonald though i would love him to be head coach but i know this just is like a conversation topic but it will be cool the ravens win this year harbaugh retires then mcdonald's get that position that would be perfect to me he's young Harbaugh got all this dang great hair now. <laughs> I'm with him. I'm wearing a hat. Y'all can't see. <laughs> but I would love that. I would love to see that. Mainly that fire that when um 
Marcus Williams got that pick. You saw that fire. Even though the game was over, that man was so hyped. That man was so freaking hyped. And I loved it. I loved it. But yeah, I I would I would like that. I would like I would like that. Because I see before I end this video, I can see that possibly happening. Because Cowboys with their situation. Dan Quinn, everybody knows that's really gonna be the head coach. But he's getting paid so much to just stay there and wait. I can see that might be could possibly happen with McDonald. He's gonna get paid really good. Just to sit there and wait. Because the owner has done that before with Eric DaCosta. Eric DaCosta was getting called from multiple teams to be their GM. The owner was like, I'm going to pay you big money to stay here and wait for Ozzy to step down. So hopefully that will happen with the head coach situation. If, if Harbaugh doesn't retire early or whatever, winning the Super Bowl... Then McDonald can sit there and wait. That is that was a good question, fam. I gotta admit. So if you all are still there, if you all have any questions, like I said at the beginning of the video, if you have any questions you would like for me to answer, get my opinion on, put them in the comments. It could be multiple questions, but I do like that. So what is y'all idea? Because I couldn't really think of no offensive coordinator, but I just love that fire that McDonald has. What, like, D3, the fam said, D'Amico Ryans, what he's doing out there with the Texans. And then you had a really good defense still with, Mc, with McDonald. And then either Todd stays or you get another young, fantastic offensive coordinator that Lamar likes. And just let's go from now. Let's go from now. That would be awesome to me. Man, yeah, that would be really cool. That would be really cool. It would be exciting. But I don't see Halls retiring, though. After a Super Bowl, I, that, that, to me, that would be cool. Because you're walking off in the sun like Ray Lewis. Then they already saying you're one of the best coaches. So you got two Super Bowls. You're like, I'm out of here. Peace. I'm going to take a break or something. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You know, money makes people change their ways. <laughs> that money makes people change their ways. Cause how many more years Harv's got anyway? Hey, I don't, I'm getting off topic again. Boy, y'all know I can go. But hey, hit the like. Hit the subscribe. Hit the share. Thank you all for the support. I'll be laughing at some of y'all comments. Y'all be having me laughing. I, I'm not, oh, before I end this video, well, I'm just going, but before I end this video, I was thinking, after the Ravens win the Super Bowl this year, would y'all like to look at the, my highlights, reactions, live when I look at my own dang highlights, reactions, because sometimes I look at it, I'll be laughing at my dang self, because I didn't know I'd be doing some of the stuff, but anyway, y'all just tell me what y'all think about that, everybody stay safe, and God bless. I'm on a whole different frequency yeah. To the point if you meant real You would tell him that he keeps it me The vibe on 11 really turned up, really turned up. Really turned up. Ride slow through the city while the trunk rattle The vibe on 11 baby turned up Be not let it hit you with the phone